in this video, I'll be showing you how to create and verify your second Alipay account using your international passport, that same international passport. Yes, I will also show you how to do it with one phone number. So it's just like a single phone number, two Alipay accounts, one passport. In summary, that would be one phone number, one international passport, two Alipay accounts. Is that not so good to hear? Okay, so this is my Alipay. When you open it, check on your profile. Profile does this part. You are seeing that part, right? Something like human being in 1D. When you click on that, so when you click, it will come to a place like this. You look for the setting icon. Let me bring this closer so we'll see, see it in real time. So in this page like this, click this setting icon, this gear icon. When you click on it, you will see something like switch account. Switch account. You are seeing it this part. Switch account. Click on that switch account. Then you'll be welcome to this. On the page like this, still click on switch account. Then, or there is another way. You can, you can decide to use the manage down part of the screen. You will see manage multiple accounts. Something like that. I'm not sure of this. I'm just trying it here. Oh, okay. Oh, it's not here. It's not here. Sorry. So let's use the switch account. So after tapping on this switch account, enter your phone number here. Three, four. Observe your country code, please. Then type your. Okay. There is something vital I, I, I should let you know here. If you check, I started with 234, then the mark. The symbol then 8100. This time I will repeat the same number. I'll use the same number, but I will introduce zero to it before the number. So in the in this case, if you use zero in your old account, that's in your current Alipay account. If there is zero in front of it, remove the zero, then repeat the number. If there is no zero, introduce a zero, then repeat the number still. Okay, I'll now put zero. Eight one. Is, uh, this is my phone number. Now click on next. So after typing your number, check down part of this sign up. Let me bring this a bit up. So if you look, you will see sign up. I see the sign up. So click on that sign up. When you click on it, allow it to load. So when it brings a page like this, when you are introduced to a page like this, what you will do is tap on this. It is change it to your country code. In my case, since I'm in Nigeria, I will just change to I'll type Nigeria. I'll change to Nigeria here. Yeah? So now the same thing you did, you repeat it. That same process. If you don't have zero in your old Alipay, introduce zero. If you have zero, don't start with zero. So the same rule I mentioned before. So I'll introduce zero like I told you. So I'll now click on sign up now. Then agree to their terms and condition. Let's build what happens. So there will be an OTP. When, OTP. when this OTP arrives your phone, you have to enter it here. I'm waiting for the OTP now. I can see take time. So the OTP just landed. I'll just enter it. So when you finish, when you are done with the OTP, you'll be logged in. You'll be logged in. You are seeing the screen, right? So what I'll do now is select your country region, your ID, all these things. I'll just select Nigeria, the same country I am in. Yes. So we are we are done with this part of it. So what's next? Now we have to verify this account. You are seeing this ad card, ad credit or debit card. You don't need it. You don't need it. So right now we have to verify this second account. What I'll do is simple. I'll tap on the profile. This this profile something here this is your profile picture or icon 
yeah that one d one dimensional image so when i click on it it will bring me to this to bring me to this place so do you know what to do now uh, i don't want to make this video long there are some things i would have shown you but i don't want to make it long or should i there's something that's supposed to show you okay i will not make it long So when you come here, click on this setting icon or this J icon, top part of the screen. This, when you click on it, you will see all those things, all those things, this thing is normally here. So, oh, oh, okay, sorry, not this, please. Um, click on this, your nickname, this is your nickname. Now when you click on this, your nickname now, ignore all these things. Ignore. Now come to a place like this. Click on this setting icon. You are seeing this setting icon or G icon, anyone. When you click on it, you see account and security. So click on this account and security. Then look down, you will see something like identity information. Verify now. I seen that. So I'll just tap on it. I'll tap on it. When you tap on it, it will it will bet you to this page it will land you to this page please give me some time give me some time please okay when you enter when you bet you to this page you don't need to start you can actually either scan to free information automatic automatically or and face it to your password or you enter it manually yes anyone that works for you yes but let me do it manually So after filling your details, down part of it, you see submit. Just click on the submit. Now when you click on the submit, allow it to load. Now when we see this, upload passport. Already I have the passport in my, in my, in my gallery. So what I'll do is upload. So when you get to this page, i won't i won't take a photo i already have it in my album like in my gallery so i'll just click on upload from album from there i'll select the passports when i select the passports then look when you select the passport look down parts down part of the screen you will see something like 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 tickets then click on something down here mark it then click on confirm when you click on that confirm, you see what happens now. Remember, we are trying to verify one, uh, two Alipay accounts with one passport and one phone number. That's the motive of this video. So it's loading. Let me give you some time. It's loading. It's still loading. Network is bit unstable. That's why it's taking time. So it's it finished loading. Please, it's okay. The phase has passed. You will see when you do this, the advantage, the beauty of this is that I will not need to, I will not need to do face verification again or facial verification because my my details is already in in the Alipay system. So that's it. Right now, if you check, I have I have verified this account. Now, so I verify this account. The next thing I'll do is I can now go to my to my account like the accounts i have okay now if we check after this process you see that the account has been verified on under identity information under identity information you see that there is now a name there you will not need to do facial verification because this passport is already in alipay system so what i'll do next is to go and check how many accounts is under this my alipay now so what i'll do now is to check to show you the number of alipay accounts i have under my portfolio <coughs> sorry so to do that find your way back to switch accounts or see where to see it on this setting icon you will see switch account now this switch account you will see this my two alipay are you seeing it the first one two three four zero 
eight one, the second one two three four eight. These two numbers are the same numbers, yet they are two different Alipay account. If you call any of this number, phone number, my device will ring. Yet I'm operating two different Alipay accounts and one passport. Verify with one passport. So that's very simple. If I can do it, you can do it. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you are not a subscriber.